Hello and welcome back to another video. In this problem, we're asked to evaluate f of negative 3, f of 0, and f of 2 for the piecewise defined function, then to sketch the graph of the function. So let's first find these values. f of negative 3. Negative 3 is less than or equal to negative 1, therefore we have to use x plus 1. Therefore we do negative 3 plus 1, which is negative 2 f of 0, 0 is not less than or equal to negative 1, and it's not greater than 1. Therefore, the function is not defined on x is equal to 0. Therefore, we can say simply that it is undefined. Finally, f of 2, 2 is greater than 1, therefore we do x squared. 2 squared is equal to 4, so that's the value of the function. Next, let's find the graph of the function. Quick drawing of the xy plane, where we have f of x on the x on the y-axis and x on the x-axis. Draw some points here on the axes, just for reference. Now, let's do it in pencil so we can do some erasing. x plus 1 is our first one, so this is a line with a y-intercept at 1 and a slope of 1. So that'll look something like this, just roughly like that. And we have y is equal to x squared. That's just the basic parabola. Going to look something like this. And we just want to make sure that the functions that we have here, x squared and x plus 1, only exist on the intervals that we need them. So f of x is equal to x plus 1, this line, if x is less than or equal to negative 1. So x is equal to negative 1 is right there. And everything else on this line, we don't use. Fill back in this parabola right here. And f of x is equal to x squared if x is greater than 1. So at x is equal to 1, we do an open circle because we're not including 1. Here, we were including negative 1. But here... I'm just doing x is greater than 1, not inclusive, so we do an open circle, and then it is continuous for the rest of the positive points. So this is the graph of the function, and these are the given values for the function f of x.